So wake stones are very important into the game, especially if you are reckless. And that, that's me included. I most definitely have not necessarily been the greatest at the game at the straightaway because I'm three hours in and I've already killed somebody that was very important to a quest line. So that is a bit unfortunate for me. But the only way that at the minute I know you can get them, other than generically going through chests, I believe you can find the shards through there. Um, again, that's going to be just throughout the game progress. The biggest way I've found to do it is through pawn quests. So if you go into a Riftstone, you will be able to find different pawns and they will come with different tasks or different quests each day. What the main one that I found that I'll show you on screen is the pawn quest where you travel day and night with a said pawn. So this is not sleeping. You've got to actually survive the day and night and you will get something called a wakestone shard. I believe once you get, I want to say it's three, but it could be four. I can't remember now is you will make a wake stone and they're going to be very important into the game because they are going to be able to either revive yourself or revive any NPCs that so happen to perish whilst on your travels. And if they require a, a, a quest, you best be able to have that wake stone next to you because they ain't coming back if you don't. 